This conference will now be recorded. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Amazon Integration Solutions demo for the Salesforce and the ServiceNow integration. In the, demo, in the demo, I'm going to walk you through how to transfer your data from Salesforce to the ServiceNow. Before moving ahead, I wanted to give you some brief about the Amazon integrations. At M1, we are helping people to migrate and synchronize their data between the applications like ServiceNow, Zira, Oracle, Confluence, MySQL, Salesforce, etc. We also provide data replication services, meaning you can transfer your data from ServiceNow to MySQL, Oracle, or MySQL. For that, there will be no need to create the tables manually. SyncSnow will help you in creating the tables as well. Today's domain is for demonstrating capabilities of SyncSnow to transfer your data from Salesforce to ServiceNow. So let's go through the demo. As you can see in the Salesforce, we have added few of the records in the scan table. So you might understand that this is for the CSM or CRM purpose. And now we are going to transfer this data from Salesforce to ServiceNow. Here you can see within the custom service model, we have account tables. And as of now, you can see there's none of the record present in the account table. So let's go to the sync nodes to transfer the records from Salesforce to ServiceNow. So it's very easy. The data, to synchronize the data, just go to the task, click on add task, give a task name, whatever you like. For example, I'm giving here SN Salesforce ServiceNow and just insert. As you wanted to transfer the data from your Salesforce, we are going to select source as a Salesforce. As you saw that, when you selected a source connection, source object is automatically popul populated. As we wanted to add the data into the service now, we are selecting target as service now. As you might already know that service now is having lots of tables, but we wanted to transfer our data to customer account for the customer service management project only. So we have plenty of fields within the account tables. We have plenty of tables in the service now customer account table. Let's click on the mapping to understand how many fields are there. So we can see on the left-hand side, it's Salesforce field. And within the right-hand side, these are the ServiceNow field. So let's map and select some of the field which we wanted to synchronize for the demo purpose. I'm selecting only three fields, which is name, phone, and website. And I wanted to transfer the data from name form website to the similar field, which is there in the service now, saying name, phone, and the website. Once your mapping is done, just click on the mapping button, uh, save, oh, sorry, OK button. You can also have an option for saving the mapping, for meaning you, you do not need to provide the mapping again and again once you save the mapping. It can be used for the future reference. For now, just click on the OK button. As you can see that we are going to transfer the data from Salesforce account table to ServiceNow customer account table. And we are going to transfer data from name to name, phone to phone, and website to website. To accomplish the synchronization task, just click on Save and Run button. Once you click on it, it is displaying a message that the process has been started. You can check the process monitor or the logs. You will get a notification if configured, meaning if you have millions of records within your ServiceNow table or the Salesforce table, you do not need to worry. Once the task is completed, you will get a notification by the email. So just click OK here. So how much time it is taking? This solution is very fast. Within 
fraction of second, you can see all the record has been transferred. So this solution is very fast. You can see that within few seconds, this record has been transferred from Salesforce to ServiceNow. You can verify the name. You can see that these are the entries here into the ServiceNow and similar things you can found here in the Salesforce. Money, we are able to successfully transfer the data between Salesforce and ServiceNow. With SyncSnow, you can also transfer the attachments. You have them, you can see that there's an option for attachments here. You can schedule your task, it, which can be run on any time. Hope uh, we are able to fulfill your comment and we are able to solve your queries on the demo. Thank you. Have a good day.